right, it's Lizzie. It is Sunday afternoon. It is, gosh, what time? 20 to 5. Um, so I have several things I told you yesterday. Well, first let me start yesterday. Thank you. Sorry, I'm fidgeting. Thank you for all the feedback on sunglasses, first of all. So I think, I think I'm going to try, I think I'm going to, I can't decide if I should send all of them back or not. Because when I really think about it, am I really going to reach for any of those over my Celine or my Dior's or like any of the other ones I wear all the time? I have other Celine's. I have Ray-Bans that I like aviators that I love. So anyway, I emailed that company, New York Glass, um, to figure out how to go about returning them. So, you know, we'll see how that goes because I told you my woes with even getting in touch with them before. So, and you have to email them to return it. So we'll see what happens. But at the least, I'm re definitely returning those blue mirrored ones. I can't remember the name of them. And then if I keep any of them, I'll keep the cha-chas and maybe the Vespers. But the order that I like them are cha-cha, then Vesper, then my girl was the blue mirrored ones. Um, and then also thank you for the <laughs> advice on the dude front. So I ended up pinging him and saying I'll give him the benefit of the doubt and we can meet like you know he gave me a date later this month when he's back in town and he said oh great you know I'll try my I'll try my best and I said do better than your best so he's clearly open to my direct feedback so that's a, a positive so we'll see what happens okay then so I told you yesterday I have like major major fashion haul to share with you. So that's why I'm in the spot that I think we don't like the lighting here as much because but I have hooked like I have a coat rack and I have that like I can hang things there. So it just makes it easier. Um, so when I left off with you yesterday, I went to Neiman's. I went and got the stuff like the trousers that were being hemmed. Um, I think I told you I bought this Alexander McQueen peplum sweater. I had the large, the extra large and the extra extra large. So I returned to, I kept one, I ended up keeping the extra large and I have it here to show you. And actually, I don't know, I may have to take, I'm layered today, it feels like fall outside, but I may have to take off this top layer so I can show you like how awesome the sweater is. Um, so anyway, I got a bunch of things, I'll show that to you. Then Alicia and I, we left there, we dumped my stuff here, we dumped some of her stuff at home and then we went over, you've heard, I go to the you know, Intercontinental all the time. We went to meal at the Intercontinental and sat outside. It was chilly, um, but they have these nice heaters. And you know what? We didn't take them up on this, but they actually will give you blankets. So all of a sudden we saw these people like draped in red. We're like, why is everybody, oh, the blankets. But you know, it's like nice to get in the last days outside. You can while you still can. So we whooped it up, drank too much pink water, you know, had a nice meal. It was really fun. And then this morning, I got up, I went for a little walk, went to the grocery store, and then I went, okay, so I have seen, you know, you do the same thing, blogs, other YouTube videos, blah, blah, blah. I had seen these by Terry eye palettes. And I decided that I was going to order one online on Beautylish, but it wasn't really the color I wanted. And I wanted to go see it in person. So the only place around here that carries the By Terry stuff is Barney's. So let me back up. First, I went to um, well, I went to the Burberry store because I really want to see the Burberry makeup like in person. And the main Burberry store on Newberry Street doesn't have the makeup. They said, oh, go to the store in Copley, which was great because it's right next to Barney's and I was going there anyway. I go there and they're like, nope, we don't carry it anymore. I'm like, well, you should tell your friends on Newberry Street because they sent me here. So anyway, so then I went into the Buy Terry, you know, to Barney's, and I got this. It's really pretty. So it's this Buy Terry Eye Designer Palette in Smoky Nude. And um, I used it today. But it's really pretty colors. Oh, God, sorry. This is, like, not a very... So there. Like, lots of really pretty... Some warmer tones, some cooler tones. I used it today. You can't really see it. And, you know, sometimes when you get a new palette, you need to play around with it, which I definitely do need to do with this. I will tell you my first reaction on this is that, you know, before I really started watching, like, YouTube videos and tutorials, when you got, like, what I guess they call fallout, I always thought that was user error. 
apparently often that's the product. <laughs> so this, there was a lot of fallout. But it could also be like it's the first time using it and blah, blah, blah. But it, the colors are gorgeous and I love it. But anyway, so at Barney's, apparently, it's their, you know, beauty event or whatever. So I got a gift with purchase. Oh, my God, would you die at this? First of all, look at this nice, like, travel, like, flannel travel bag. It is, I have never gotten a gift bag. Oops, so full like this. And I just want to tell you some of the high, I mean, there's so much stuff in here, I couldn't tell you all of it. But okay, first of all, the La Mer, um, like this mask, that's awesome. I don't know what this is. Organic rice milk and cherry blossom foaming shower oil. Look, that is a full size. I wonder what it smells like. It smells really nice. Um, so that is a full size thing. The other thing that I got that I thought was really neat was look at this really cute, like look at this color, Deborah Lip Lipman. It's like a pink glittery polish. It's like, I'm sure it's too small. Sweet Dreams it's called. Um, and then this, I have no idea what this lipstick queen li liquid lips is, but this is a full size like lipstick of some, you know, Lipstick. I think it's one of those you have to pump because it's white and I didn't pump it yet, so I don't really know anything about the color, but I'm going to definitely try that. I mean, and there was something else that was really good. Oh, this Moroccan oil body moisturizer. Like, that's a nice size for travel. I feel like there was one other really good thing in here. Oh! This is like a NARS orgasm blush. So this gift bag was really, I've never ever seen a gift bag like this. And I mean, that's only a drop in the bucket. Like this thing is stuffed, stuffed to the brim. Okay, then, so just so you know, I'm wearing, um, I don't think I've ever really talked to you about this before. You can't really tell how pretty it is. But the, these NARS dual intensity blushes, this is Fervor. This is what I'm wearing today. Like, look at how pretty these colors are. And these are those, like, you can use them wet or you can use them dry if you want to get more intensity out of them. So this is really pretty. And then on my lips today is this NARS pencil. Um, New Lover Velvet Gloss Lip Pencil. So this is it. The one thing I will say is it's really soft. So like you can kind of see the tip, oh sorry, the tip, see how it's kind of like broken? So you have to be careful when, don't go too crazy putting it on clearly like I did. Um, okay, so then I will show you, so of my major fashion haul, let's start with the shoes. So one pair of shoes I got yesterday and one pair of shoes I had got I, I might have told you about them, but I definitely didn't show you. So, first of all, I got these Saint Laurent booties like, to die for. Ah. Ay, ay, ay. Actually, if you want to see the details of what they are. But, um... Okay, it's gorgeous. And they're, they're a really good, you know, how I like this kind of heel. Um, and I'll wear these with jeans, with trousers, with skirts. And I mean, some of the stuff I have over there to show you, like these are going to be worn over and over again. Okay. Then, sometimes when I get dressed and I want, um, you know, like a flat, like a more casual shoe, either to wear on my way to work and then I can change into a higher heel or just on a weekend when I'm popping around, like instead of a regular round toe flat, like I want a pointy toe flat, it just seems sometimes a little chicer, more polished. And like yesterday, remember I, had, I wore a pair of Christian Louboutin pointy flats that have, you know, like kind of some metal gold hardware. So yesterday, these are actually also Christian Louboutin. I got these nude um, Louboutin, just with like these delicate little you know how I love the studs and the hardware studs. Um, these are, this to, actually I should tell you what those are, don't I? Angelina Flat Kid Nude Light Gold. 
39 and a half. I'm generally a nine, but the nine was too small on me for those. And then these, I should tell you what they are. Manto Natural, I don't know if that's what it's called. I guess it is. And these I got in the size 39, which is my normal size, the booties. Um, okay, so I think that's it for the shoes. So I guess now I'll show you the clothes. Hold on. Okay, so I'll start with this. This is, I told you I got this really, this is a Michael Kors jacket, short sleeve. It's, um, what is it made of? It must, it's a really soft, maybe like a wool. And with these like skinny, pardon the tissue, Michael Kors trousers. So these will look so good with, first of all, either pair of the shoes I just showed you and the Valentino bag that I've been carrying over and over again. Um, so I love this and this so this I think I told you it's interesting because this jacket thing is a size 8 which I am generally um, you know larger on top so it's very unusual for a size 8 but it's oversized and these pants I think are size 12 um, which I'm usually a 10 on the bottom so this just goes to show you have to try everything on because every brand is different. But so here are the pants. Look at them, love them. And then, um, okay. What next? Oh, the white Michael Kors trousers that I got. Now, a couple of these things I already showed you. But, well, let's go with this. these I already showed you but I just want to show you again because so these are the these I think I also got in a size 12 look at these gorgeous winter white like wide leg like they have a such a nice break at the bottom um, trouser they're just beautiful oh I'm gonna have to be very careful with these because I'm not always the neatest person I'm a little klutzy but um, these are the length are such that I should be able to wear them with flats or like with those, um, those Saint Laurent booties I just showed you. And this will go like, first of all, this is a Lafayette like sweater coat. So I can wear these together. Like, look at how gorgeous this is. Like, this is like chic to wear with these pants or on a weekend with jeans, but it's just beautiful. And you know what? I think it might be reversible. I think it's reversible. It's gorgeous. Like, look at this. And actually, with the um, the Louboutins, like, just everything that I'm buying goes with each other. Then I showed you these. Oh, shoot, I showed you these before, but the Michael Kors pants with the Alice and Olivia cape are gorgeous and also with my Tahari um, coat like if I want to do like an all white like an all winter white thing okay and then I have just a couple more things okay one is these are the same These are these long cashmere sweaters. You can't tell, one's navy, one's black, and actually I have a camel one that I've already worn. But they're these nice long sweaters, which I love to wear over like a pencil skirt or a dress. And these are the Neiman Marcus brand sweaters, and I got the extra large. Um, and they're super, the Neiman Marcus cashmere is beautiful and it's super soft. And these are, these were, I don't see the price. I think they were $2.75, which for the quality cashmere they do is really nice. So these will be on rotation, especially as I'm always freezing at work. And then lastly, so when I, I forgot to tell you this yesterday, but when I was in Bergdorf's last week, I was, well, I kind of told you, but I didn't tell you the whole story. When I was in Bergdorf's last week, I told you I was looking, I had a targeted search going on. And I wanted a black 
Classic Black Blazer. Now you may recall that I have a white Stella McCartney Classic Blazer that I love. And um, so I, I just, her blazers are generally like roomy enough. Oh, I can't sit down yet. I have a McQueen sweater still. Um, but anyway, her blazers are generally roomy enough that for me they fit. And so I found this just classic black blazer. Um, now I subsequently found a very similar blazer online on Neiman Marcus on sale for half the price. So that is on its way to me. So I'll decide if I keep this one or that one. But hold on, I'm going to take this off so I can show you this sweater because it doesn't do it justice if I don't put it on. Hold on. Okay, so this is the Alexander McQueen sweater with this like exaggerated peplum. Oh my god, I just love it. Now it's, I'm not going to, but this is the extra large. They had an XXL. It's not going to button, but I don't want it to button. Like I like it like this and the XXL looked too sloppy, too big in the shoulders and didn't like fall at the right place. Like I'm okay with how it just falls there. And I like the kind of, like it's a look with the really long like bell sleeves. But yeah, this is the Alexander McQueen sweater. And actually, since I'm doing this, I'll show you this blazer. I'll try it on. Because it's just a great classic blazer. So if the other one that was half the price is anything like this, I'll keep that one and send this one back but I, I love it. It's just exactly what I wanted. Um, yeah. So I think that's it. I'm wearing my Dylan Lux necklace today. AG, distressed jeans, Hermes cuff. This is a Lafayette. Um, actually, it's really cute. This is just a white button down, but like, look at, I don't know if you can see in the collar. I don't think you can. There's, it's got this like little chain detail, which is really nice. Um, anyway, so that's my major fall fashion haul. And um, I don't think I need to buy anything else for a while. I think you'll all agree. But I, I was kind of, I hadn't shopped for a while, so I was overdue. So I went crazy. <laughs> anyway, so it's now, five, you know, whatever time I told you, 5 o'clock Sunday. I'm meeting a friend that I met actually through here for sushi tonight for dinner and then um, you know then tomorrow it's just back to work so I guess that's that I hope you've had a great weekend I'll see you soon bye